Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Medieval's Dynasty. Hopefully, everyone is having a great day today. If you're watching this later on YouTube, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Every little bit helps, guys. So, and now for the main event here as we continue on with our story of life in the medieval times. So, all right, there we go. Like I said, hopefully everyone is having a great day today. Glad everyone could be here. Well, what's up, Spider? How you doing today? Glad you're here. All right, and I, now it's just the time of just remembering what we were doing, why we were doing it, and um, yeah, all this other fun stuff that we got to remember what to do. But yeah, we'll, we'll be just fine. We'll be just fine. All right, it's nighttime in the last day. Um, let's see here. What were we doing? That is the question. What's up, mister? Ah, uh, no, no, no. I'm glad that you are here. That's better. What is this guy doing? This guy's freaking out here. It's like, dude, you cannot walk through there. I can walk through there, but you can't. Your pathing just isn't good. What's up, Luke? How you doing? Glad you're here. I am doing just, just well, just well. Thank you very much for asking. My house is now quiet. Uh, yep, no, we're going to be streaming for a little bit here. Um, my daughter just, um, had her 16th, uh, birthday party. So yeah, um, I was hoping I'd get on yesterday, but yeah, there were, I had too many teenage girls in my house and, uh, yeah, they weren't quiet at all. So, uh, oh, Gigi streaming right now too. Well, thank you very much, Luke. Thank you very much. So I figured yeah, I'd come in here and, uh, and do something, even though I can't remember what I was doing. So. Uh, it's nighttime. We're just going to go to bed. Uh, let's just go to bed. Yeah, we'll, we'll sleep with the wife. Why not? We'll sleep with the wife. Yeah, you got both up. All right. Well, uh, I didn't know. I didn't get any notification that uh, he was up unless he's still going from his original stream as of today. But um, well, I didn't know he was still up. Well, that's awesome, though. Good. Good. Yeah. Good. Good, good for him, though. So. All right, um, no quest to do. All right, so it's just going to be crafting. That's what we're going to do today. What are we going to craft? Uh, what do we got in our chest here? Because I know they changed to where they uh, cannot uh, add more than what it is. No, he said on his end of the last one, he's doing another one like an hour and 20 minutes. Just, oh, okay. I, did, I, I wasn't there for the end, so I don't know. So that's awesome, though.
I know that. I, I know that. It's a separate stream. I actually caught the notification because I was already on YouTube watching the rest of the previous stream. Oh, look at that. Yeah, I know. Like I said, I know he streamed earlier today, but I didn't know he was doing it again. And we have 939 iron arrows. I think we should uh, start taking our arrows somewhere and maybe selling them. But uh, we might probably have to wait for another season. Uh, well, we have a bunch of flax we can go uh, thrash, so why not? Uh, do we have anything else we can thrash while we're there? No. All right. So let's go uh, thrash some uh, flax here. Get a bunch of thrax, flax seeds. There we go. I can talk, really. I can. I don't know where I'm going, but I can talk. Yeah. Excuse me, man. But uh, since you won't do this, I got to do it for you, you know. Oh, yeah, and since uh, JQ sent you here, uh, let me let me stop this here real quick. Uh, let me equip the crossbow, and let's see if we can thrash again here. And he, th he should thrash with the crossbow. Nope, he actually switched, so maybe they fixed it. But, yeah, before it didn't matter what you had in your hand, you could thrash. So I know we talked about that on, the, on Discord there, so. But they might have changed because I know they changed all the sounds and all that too. So that's probably what they did when they did that. All right. This is kind of weird, but my stream deck is completely frozen. On my stream deck, there's a there's a clock, and it is completely frozen. So I, I can't do any shout-outs to anybody or anything like that. So, uh, yep, sorry. Everything's going to have to be manual until the stream deck decides to wake up again. I mean, it, it can't be a stream if everything's going right, right? Thank you for the host, Arizona. Glad to have you here. Hopefully you are doing well. I know you said that you'll be working this weekend before they shut you guys down. So, uh, yeah, get as much uh, time in as you can, man. But hopefully you're having a good one today, Zona. We're just thrashing away here, you know. Some heavy metal thrashing. Not really heavy metal, though. It's more like a wood. But uh, I can't even imagine doing this back in the day. I can't imagine doing it at all. Having to beat this all the time. I don't know if I could do this. It was tough. It was tough growing up back in the day, wasn't it? <laughs> I mean, who would have thought that, you know, all this modern technology would have been really, you know, so much better than medieval times, you know. We grew up in a world of cars, electricity, you know, heat. So, yeah, and they had a, you know, they had a really rough it there, you know. I'm so glad I wasn't born in the 1800s or else we'd have to do this, right? This is going to take a while here. This is a perfect way to start a stream out right here. The awesome, just awesome way. Hey, let's do something really completely boring to where anybody who's coming into the stream just goes, ah, I don't want to watch this. And then, you know, they go out. Oh, trust me, Luke, I understand. If Gargoyle's streaming, hey, I understand. I, I'm just honored that you guys are here and you're counting as a viewer. So that's awesome. Long day at work, managed to oversleep as well. Not much. Luckily, I have a few minutes away. Yeah, that's good. That's good. I mean, you might as well get all the long days in right now, right? I'm sure you, you're trying to deplete all the, as much stock as you guys can before you guys get shut down, so. But yeah, I mean, hopefully uh, you're uh, prepared for it or, you know, the best you can be anyways. So, 
Just think, oh, yeah, well, Streamlabs woke up. That's good. Uh, just think, though, you'll have more time to, um, you know, to stream yourself, right? So that's always one positive way to look at it, right? You're mentally preparing for it? Yeah. That's good. That's good. I mean, you got to be prepared for it, right? You, you got to be prepared for whatever comes, whatever issues that might arise or anything like that. Yeah, just be mentally prepared. And hopefully, you know, nothing goes wrong and, you know, you, you, you escape out of it, you know, and you're a better person because of it, right? So... Yeah, just think of all the wood you can dry now on Lumberjacks, you know? I mean, come on. You can do what no one else wants to do is, you know, dry all that wood. Oh, yeah, no, just you got you got to take it day by day. I mean, there is no other way to take it other than day by day. So. You can try to prepare for stuff, but, um, you know, always be prepared for the un unexpected, you know, type of thing. So, and don't let life get you down, you know? As the old saying goes. You still got 800 plus to dry, yeah. Yeah, that's a lot of wood. I'm sure you'll have fun doing it, though. <laughs> I know I won't. I got, I got tons of wood I got to dry, too. Need to finish the replanting. I'm still waiting on all my stuff to grow. All my stuff to grow. So it's going to take me a while. Okay, we're nearing completion here on the flax grain. So that's good. One day soon we'll be done with this though. So. Hey, there we go. All right, there you go. I did all your work for you. Quit going through my walls, cows. I wish they would uh, kind of fix that to where the animals can't go through uh, fences and stuff. Is that my kid? That is my kid. Wow. Whoa, what the heck did happen there? You got some supernatural powers there. All right, so let's get rid of the grain... No, not the grain. We'll get rid of the flax stalk. There we go. Now there's a bunch of flax stalk that you can spin into linen. So that'll keep my uh, my sewing people busy. And how are we doing on the food issues here? I know again, boring way to start an episode here, but uh, we gotta we, we gotta do it here. Uh, food is doing okay. Um, actually, no, the grains don't go in here, do they? But we're going to put the grains in here because, yeah, why not? Um, all right. Did they eat all the bread that we made or the meat singer bombers that we made? It looks like it. The meat uh, meat pies. Looks like they, they need, actually need some. There's no, there's no prepared meals in here. Huh, all right. Well, then we'll, we'll do this. Grab our onions. And that's roasted meat. We'll make some food for our people. I mean, you know, you don't want them to go uh, hungry, right? I mean, actually, I don't care, but. I've been good. I've been good, Luke. How you been? All right, so we'll make a bunch of meat with gravy here. So, and then, um, I, again, I wish the cooking was faster. I just, I so wish it was faster. But we got to get our people some meals here. I mean, I think they're good just eating the roasted meat and uh, all the other stuff. But, um, 
you know, it would be nice to get him some meals every now and then. Plus, it uses up our inventory up, too. Because right now, all we have are the people working in the tavern. Is All they're doing is roasting meat. That's all they're doing is roasting meat. So, you're good? Glad to hear. Glad to hear. Why'd you say sorry, though? Well... Those cows are loud, I tell you that. What's up, Target? How you doing? Glad to have you here. <clears throat> You're 33 today, Penny? Well, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Glad to have you here, by the way, too. How many woodsheds are my operating? I, I have one woodshed. That's all I have. Everyone wish Miss Penny there a happy birthday to her. Oh, okay. Oh, you're fine, Luke. Like I said, you're going to be in and out. I understand that. You know, you're a moderator over at Gargoyle, you know. You, you, got, you got jobs to do. And I completely understand it. There you go, Penny. Luke is from, uh, you know, your neck of the woods, too. All right. So we are going to uh, put some food in here now. Now we got meat with gravy. Yeah, she's from... Uh, look at that. Look at that. Thank you very much, Mr. J. For the gifting of the sub. That is awesome. That is awesome. <clears throat> Alright, what else can we do here? Uh, do we have cabbage? I don't think we have cabbage. Oh, look at that. All the birthday wishes are coming in. Uh, uh, how much flour do I have? Do I have any flour? I have only had 19 flour. That's not enough flour. Uh, I don't have many more vegetables here. We have carrots. And I don't know what can I do. Can I make like stew or something like that? I think that's what it is. With carrots or is it is that the beets? I think that could be the beets, but we'll find out. Oh, wrong way. Uh, it is stew. All right. And it takes three carrots. Awesome. Whoa, excuse me, ma'am. All right, we can make 25 stews, get rid of out of there. Oh, thank you very much, Penny. Thank you very much. You cheered as many bits as how I am old. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. What's up, Danny K? How you doing? How you doing? Glad to have you here. How are you doing, Mrs. Danny K? You're you're catching the the boring parts of the stream here, so you know we're doing all bunch of crafting here right away. Been playing Civ Five, really? Or no, uh, Civ? Did you mean five or six? Because you put an exclamation point there. Six? Okay. Yeah, um, I, I, I love Civilization. Um, Civilization is uh, really good. Um, I wasn't so much keen on the newer ones, though. I like the older ones better. Maybe it's nostalgia reasons, but um, uh, Civ Six is a really good game. Um, but, um, yeah. What's up, Karen? How you doing today? How is the game? The game is going awesome. I think you were asking about the watchdogs, though, but this game is awesome, but I'm sure you already knew that. that's why you're here. But uh 
Yeah, I'm I'm interested to see the the new Watchdogs too. I have both the other Watchdogs. I've never played a single minute of them though. I got them for free and uh, I've never played a single minute. So yeah, I have so many games that I got to catch up on though. All right, uh, what did we run out of? Did we run out of um, carrots? Yep, we have one carrot left. All right, so at least we we have some other stuff here that we just made, so that's good. Have you played the other Watch Dogs there, Penny? Do I have... Oh, I have more... All right, okay, no, I don't. Uh, all we have is meat. No? Okay. I'm just curious on which um, which Watch Dog is, uh, is the best. I had four countries declared war, got my boats together, and kicked butt. My son told me to calm down. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Yep, yep. No, Civilization is so much fun. Um, have you ever played any of the older ones? Uh, any of the older Civilizations? I love all the Civilization. The new one is in London? That's cool. No, wish you had. All right, well, yeah, maybe we can do... Um, maybe we can do a Civilization stream one day. Looking to pick up the new Assassin's Creed, yeah. Uh, the Assassin's Creed um, games look fun, too. Uh, Civilization can be difficult, uh, Penny. I know you're asking uh, Danny, but uh, uh, it can be. It all depends on your strategy and your settings. I mean, if you put it on easy, it's it's easy, of course. But once you get up into the tougher settings, uh, it is... Oh, yeah. And, and Danny, you will always still learn. There is so many tricks of, of everything of that game. Um, there's a lot to do in Civilization. You pre-order the Assassin's Creed one? You get it on Tuesday? That's cool. Oh, well, there's a fox. I'll just shoot you. All right. And we'll, uh, I only, only thing I want is the fur and the leather, though. That's all I want. I don't care about the meat. But we'll get it. We'll get the meat. I don't care. If it goes rotten in our um, in our food storage, oh well, at least we got some rot. Well, that's another thing we probably could have done. We got a bunch of rot. We could probably could have made that into fertilizer. 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 You saw a lot of reports. Maybe one day. Yeah. Yeah. There's just so much stuff to do in uh, civilization. Luke five. Oh yes, got Luke five. There you go. Oh, why are you running away? Yeah, I, I just, I can't talk. We'll see on Tuesday after I buy the essential stuff I need for the apartment. Oh, yeah, yep. Yeah, you got to you gotta remember, Zona, with, um, you know, everything is a luxury uh, except for the necessities, right? <laughs> oh, there you go. Shoot you in the back of the head. I'm not even a decent person. I'll just shoot you in the back of the head. All right. Where is another one at? Let's load up again. A new chair is high priority. Yeah, I mean, but see, I still have my old chair. Um, only because, I mean, yeah, it is a high want, but that's all it is is a want. It's not a need. I mean, I'll sit on a milk crate. I don't care. I mean, my back's not going to like it, but I'll sit on it. Oh, great. Oh, why are you running away, dear? Come on. How about you? Ooh, there's a bison over there, too. Well, let's go after him, actually. I see him in the distance. Make sure, is he the only one out here? He is. Come on. Yep, do your little shake. There you go. Oh, yeah, we got to hydrate. There we go. And whoa, what the heck happened there? There's all kinds of weird things going on today in the graphics. All right, while we skin it, we're going to re redeem our hydrate. Uh, 
Pink lemonade, gallop it. All right. Um, okay, let's just keep on going after the deer. I mean, all we're doing is kind of killing time here, waiting on the next season. So we can get some more uh, more quests. Maybe we can get in a, Maybe we'll get lucky and actually get an event. You know, we haven't had an event yet. I've seen some people get like events of like the king is coming and stuff like that. So that'd be kind of cool. And I know I've seen an event where uh, like a bad storm came by and they had to repair like almost all their buildings. So that was that was kind of neat, too. There's so there's some cool stuff that goes on in the game. It's just I don't know if we've been fortunate or unfortunate that we just haven't got any yet. So because I don't know what the if there's any benefits or not. Possessed villagers, animals, wonder what they'll possess next. Have seen the loom work on its own with no villagers nearby. Oh, yeah. No, I mean, everything is possessed in this game. Yes, I'm still looking for Funky Town. I, I like that you read the title of that. Most people don't even read the title. I always try to put something funny in there. I don't know why. Um, but, yeah, I'm, I'm still looking for Funky Town. If anyone knows where Funky Town is, please let me know. I mean, and don't get confused with the Uptown Funk, you know. We're just looking for Funky Town. I mean, it is Saturday, right? Saturday night? <clears throat> I mean, but I guess according to Elton John, it's Saturday night's all right for fighting too, though. So who knows? I'm just killing everything here, and I don't know why. We really don't need any of the meat. Is this coming to console? Um, all right. The truth is, I don't know. I believe it will be, but it won't be like Farmer's Dynasty. The Farmer Dynasty uh, people that they had to convert it over to console really messed things up for toplets. This is a completely different thing. Um, so I would like to say so, but I don't think they are going to release it to console until it is 100% ready as in, a, as in a complete game. And what did you find? No, you're talking about, you know, Penny, about all the, all the mess ups that happened, you know, about, you know, the game is done um, on PC, but... You know, you guys on console haven't been able to enjoy it yet. Isn't it the one behind Veronica? I heard it's pretty funky in its own way. <laughs> where, where's Funky Town, Luke? Tell me where Funky Town is. You got to quit moving, animals. How am I supposed to shoot you if you keep on moving? Atlanta Funky Town is a cultural meeting pond near downtown Atlanta. See, but you no, know, that's not that, that's Atlanta Funky Town. We're just looking for Funky Town, not Atlanta Funky Town. No, there's a lot more you still need, Penny. And they just put out a DLC for Farmers Dynasty too, where you get the potatoes and uh, and uh, beets. Now, yeah, beets. Right. The turnips, as they call them. So, yeah, there's still a lot that you. No, no, that's not the one, man. That's not the one. See, that's just a place called Funky Town. We're looking for the actual Funky Town. And I need to get some water. No one's telling me that I need to drink. All right, let's go get something to drink here. Uh, I think there's another rabbit over here, though, right? Yeah, right there. Let's kill this rabbit. Oh, but he ran off. Okay. The water's right here. Let's go get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now you tell me to drink. I see how it is. Never been to Atlanta one many moons ago. Oh, you've been to the Atlanta one many moons ago. All I remember was that it was really loud. Uh, yeah. 
Um, it is end of the season, but um, it, it's okay. Drinking is drinking. You know, it's not like it cost us anything. Um, let's get rid of everything that we have here. We probably have quite a bit. Uh, yeah, I picked up 40 meat, 11 fur, 21 leather. All right. Yeah, it's not, not too bad on a day of hunting here. Uh, we might as well cross over here because we need some, uh, we need to bathe here. Right, where is my entrance at? Or we need to hurry up and get a bunch of wool too, so we can make a bunch of more lanterns. I want to make a just a bunch of lanterns, a lanterns around here. Yep, come on, guys, it's time to go back inside. I want this place all lit up. Funky Town is a slang name for the city of Fort Worth, Texas. I'm gonna go smoke a flat in Funky Town. Yeah, I mean that again is a slang term. I'm looking, whoa, what the heck, man? What are you doing up there? What is going on with all the graphics today? All the graphics are kind of giving me glitches here. I mean, that's a pretty high sheep right there. I mean, it's a good thing that the cow, cow wasn't up there, though, because then it'd be pretty high stakes. Boom, boom, ch. Um, hey, wow, look at that. Somebody's sitting here. Nice. Oh, I know. I know. They do that all the time. I, 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 I could take, I could take screenshots and do all that too. I just, I never, I, it doesn't bother me at all. I, I know stuff like this is going to happen in an early access game. And if you're not the first person to do it, it doesn't it doesn't matter anymore. Um, what am I looking for? I don't even know. I'm looking for something to do. I feel like crafting. How much leather and fur do we have here? Oh no, I agree. Some of it's really funny. Um, I won't disagree with you there. All right, we need to stock up on fur and leather because we just we need to do do that. Uh, we do have rot. We can do some rot. Take train, change that into manure. Um, I might as well take our one manure here. Uh, do we have any fertilizer here? No. Okay. So they are. That's right. That's one of the things that the uh, farm people are doing is making manure when they can, or making fertilizer, I should say. All right, maybe we'll get lucky and tomorrow we'll have another worker or something that uh, we can use. We got to get some of these mothers back. We, we got way too many mothers. That's the one thing we wish you could do, sit on the bench or a stool in the game. Yes, yes, I agree. And welcome, Dark Arrow. Glad you're here. Yeah, it'd be, it'd be interesting if we could actually do that. I mean, we can make it. Why can't we interact with it, you know, type of thing. So, yeah, we can make a bench or make a stool, but oh, we can't do anything with it. So, it doesn't, it doesn't make a lot of sense, but hey, you know, it is the medieval times after all. All right, where is my pile of, there it is. We Again, we're going to have tons of fertilizer here. And I grabbed manure, and I don't know why I grabbed manure. Uh, dude, you, you all, man, what's what's in the box, man? What's in the box? You guys are all blocking it. Yeah, you know, we can watch the villagers do it, yeah. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know. There's nothing in there that we need. All right, do we have a torch on us? No, we don't have a torch on us. All right. Normally I don't do this, but we'll do this. We're going to do this again. We're going to sleep again and wake up and it should be winter time. I think if I'm reading that symbol, right? Sleep. <clears throat> Ooh, we have a man in tights. A noble man was passing through the village. He lost his purse in front of you. What will you do? 
Ooh, we have a... I know that's a negative five on the mood, but we need dynasty points. We need the dynasty reputation points. Let your people have it. Take it for yourself. Um, I got to give it back. I got to give it back. So uh, one. Uh, F, choose answer. The normal one was pleased and says you're a man of honor. Your people, however, wanted it for themselves and are a bit upset. Man, that's all right. All villagers lost five mood. But there we go. That is a something that was added to the game. We got our first one. And why are we sleeping with the kid again? You want to explain something to me, wife? Hmm? All right. What's going on? We have three quests in our town again. There's always quests in our town. Uh, do you got a quest? Can I help you? I could use your help. I want to, uh, okay, that's fine. We'll get a hammer. Okay, one hammer. Uh, what do you want? Can I help you with something? Uh, okay, that's fine. Noble shoes. We got the Somi quest. Okay, where is the next one at? Quiet. What's quiet? The chat's quiet? You in the, I know. I must be in the doghouse again, though. Come on. Come on. Come here. Uh, okay, fine. So he needs a bow. All right, so we need a hammer. Um, the Somi quest is what? Uh, oh, yeah, the deliver. So we need a hammer, an iron hammer. And, oh, 46 stone arrows, really? Why is it always got to be stone arrows all the time? I don't know if I have 46 stone arrows or not. Hopefully I got enough feathers and everything. And the kid just, the kids don't sit on the stools, though. They, they just sit on the floor. I find it funny. All right. Uh, we need a iron hammer. There we go. You grab this one. Um, oh, I have 42 stone arrows. Darn it. I think I need it 48. So we are going to need some feathers and some stone and some sticks. And I know I'm overweight here. So we'll get rid of the crossbow. We'll get rid of the knife. Get rid of these bolts here. Um, get rid of my manure, get rid of the rot. Okay, we're going to be moving a little bit slow, but that's fine. All right. Um, okay, we have the hammer. Yeah, I need to make four arrows. Come on. Maybe Igor has some vodka? He, maybe, I don't know. It, it very well possibly could be. All right, we are going to do the house renovation one first. That way we drop weight. Where's this guy at? It looks like he's in this house. He's a sewer, huh? Hey, what's up, man? Here you go. All right, and then we want the time to hunt one. All right, we got to go make some arrows. All right. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> All right. Um, dun, 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 dun. Crafting stone arrows. I know the cows are, yeah. All right, time to hunt. Here we go. Now you can go, honey, man. Oh, you're on the other side of the fence too, aren't you? Yes, you are. All right, let's go. Got to go through the opening, wherever that is. Right there. I found out, went overweight a bit. If you hold the W and the ARD, uh, yep. Yeah, there's all types of different things you can do to move quicker. Um, also, if you're overweight, you can move the, you can hit the uh, W key plus the up arrow. Um... That works. Really? Dude, the buck is right there, man. Shoot him. 
Is this why you need the arrows? Because you suck at hunting? Oh, and he gave us fur. All right, well, that's fine. Yeah, like I'm overweight now. This is just the W key. This is how fast I move when I hold the up key. Also, if you have the caps lock on, it moves you, you, moves you even slower. So make sure your caps lock is off. And you know about the auto walk, right? The shift and uh, the number eight on the keypad or the eight on the numpad for the auto walk. All right, looks like our goat thing or bobber needs to be fixed too. Our uh, keep. Oh, yes. Don't forget to look five. Yep. All that good stuff. Yep. All right. So now we're going to go deliver some shoes over to Lumbarana or Lumbarina or whatever. Uh, Luba. Uh, we'll just call her Luba. So. All right. Uh, we don't need any of this stuff. I don't need this stuff. I don't need this stuff. I don't need this stuff. All right. And uh, I don't need that stuff. Okay, so we'll add up the crossbow again. I think uh, I should get a desktop computer instead of a laptop to play this game. Um, you can do it with a laptop. It's just um, you, you're going to have to spend a lot of money on, the, on, a, on a gaming laptop in order to get one that is good enough and all that. And then you have to watch out on your heat issues for the laptop. There's There's a lot of things that can go... I mean, is it easier just to get um, uh, a desktop? Yes, it is. It is just easier to get a desktop. Oh, I don't need to equip that. That's right. Um, okay, we get, we're good. Not grabbing any food or anything. All right. But yes, I, in my opinion, desktop computing is the way to go. Um, I'm biased, though, because uh, I have a desktop. But um, to me, a desktop is just the best way to go. You can do so much more with it, and then you have the capability of upgrading it all the time. Amazon has renewed computers, not as expensive as a new one. Um, yes, but they're still going to have a markup on them. Um in my opinion, and this is just my opinion, uh, find somebody who has um, some decent computer skills, if you don't have them yourself, and just build one. Uh, and if, like I said, if you can't build one, then have somebody else build one for you. Um, but that is the way to go. Uh, building a computer is definitely the way to go. And what are you doing? You're running away. Yeah, you got to watch out on the renewed ones though, because they're 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 just not the same. Uh, they're still markups, and they're still gonna have older older stuff in them. They're just trying to get as much as they can out of them. So, all right, uh, we're gonna Luke five here, and we're going to go after this guy. Because I I just want all the fur. Give me all the fur. Give me all your fur. He, yeah, I know. He was actually running away. I know. It's, I don't know why. I've never seen him actually run away. They always run towards you. I mean, if, you know, as much as I can anyways. So there we go. We got some fur and some leather off these guys. Nothing really gives a lot of fur, though, except for wolves. I mean, I take that back. This gives you four, so that's pretty good, but... Uh, if that rabbit's going to stay there, I'm going to shoot him. Because, well, you know, I want the fur. And if that rabbit's going to stay there, we'll shoot him too. We still need to get our hunting skills up here, so why not? All 
What the heck? Come on. You gave me like the whole animation, but never cleaned them up. There we go. All right, well, let's go to the town here. Uh, do another Luke 5 here, and away we go. Now, if we get hungry, though, we can just make a... I don't have a, I don't have a torch on me. Forget that. Can't make a campfire. Don't have a torch. We'd have to go make a torch. Then that means we'd have to go near the water again. And I have not looked to see where any other quests are right now. Geronimo! What's up, girl? How you doing? How you doing? All right. Yep, yep, yep. That's fine. Okay. Now we got to go back. Uh, let's see where any of the other quests are. There is one in the next town over, so let's go there, actually. Uh, which is going to be west. Yeah, no, at least we had a knife. Exactly, exactly. You, 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 you've been here long enough to know that I'm constantly forgetting my knife. I made sure I grabbed the knife. Wait, am I going the right way? No, I need to go each. What are we doing? I don't even know which way I'm going. Okay. Uh, how much rep points do we have here? Um, we're almost at 12,000. And we need to get to 16,000. Jeez, old Pete. It's going to take us a long time to get to 16,000, I think. Especially when we're only getting like 20, 30 points at a time. If, if for, you know, like a max. I guess we might as well go to Boro too while we're over here. Where was the waterfall? The waterfall was in um, this location here near, near Denica, I think it is. Oh, no, no, you're fine. You're fine. You're fine. Uh, but yeah, there's, there's, I think there's waterfalls everywhere there. That was just one of them. Uh, just follow the, follow the streams um, and you'll be able to find them. So it's, I know it's not on this one. So I'm thinking it's on this one. I think it's right there, right in this area or maybe further up. I know it's on that river though. And you're fine. Talking is talking. You know, if you're talking Exactly. You know, someone has to talk. Why would you need 16,000 rep points? Have you not have have not heard anything like that for anyone? Or is it just a goal for you? Uh, no, uh, here's the issue. Uh, here's the issue. And I'll show you uh, if there's someone here I can recruit. I just got to find someone I can recruit here. All right. Uh, what about you? Can I recruit you? No, uh, maybe if we get lucky. Uh, I just got back. Oh, fine. You didn't like that. Uh, what about you? You got a moment? Uh, heard any gossip? Okay. Got a moment? Uh, nice weather? You didn't like that one. Okay. Uh, how you been? All right. All right. See, I'm going to I'm gonna click. I'm creating a new settlement. I've heard you are building your reputation up. Keep going. I might consider your proposition. Reputation required 16,000. I can't get any more people unless I get 16,000 rep points. Ooh, and I just leveled up diplomacy. Nice, finally. Oh my gosh, diplomacy takes so long. All right, so we are going to uh, raise up the, probably the seller. We'll, we'll get 5% higher sell prices. That'd be nice. There we go. Now we make 5% more money. Uh, who had the quest here? You do. Is it you? No, it's you. No, 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 no. Can I help you with something? I really need new boots. All right, fine. Okay, that's new for me, but I have a max building and 35 population. I have max building and 43 people, I think it is. Uh, what? How many people do I have? I have 41, sorry, 41. Oh, hydrate, thank you very much. So, yeah. Now, and the thing is, too, how many kids do you have? Because, you know, kids, you know, are always with that family, but... 
So I don't know if it's, you know, for something when you get over 40. I don't know. But I have I have an empty house. And I have a damaged house. Wow, look at that. But yeah, see, I have an empty house. Zero out of four people living there. And I have a bunch of uh, four out of four, so that's good. But yeah, I have an empty house here. And I'm trying to get people to live into it. Oh, posture check. Yeah. Oh, ew, that, that felt good. Back crack there. All right, and now we are going to go uh, southeast. All right, southeast. But yeah, um, before the update, it was 13,000 um, dynasty points. And then it after the update, it went to 16,000. No, I'm sorry, it was 12,000. And that's why I was like really close to it. I'm like, all right, cool. But yeah, I went up to um, to that. So am I going the right way? No, I'm not. We need to go this way more. So yeah, it'll be interesting to see what I can do. Oh, and there's some other big guys. Come here, big guy. Uh, why won't you load, man? There you go. There's some pigs too. I don't really want the pigs. I just want you. Because I want the fur. I don't mind making the noble boots and the boots with the fur and all that. There you go. Come to Papa. Come to Papa. Come here. I got something to show you. Does this look sharp to you? But yeah, it's gonna. So it's it's gonna take us a long time to get to sixteen thousand. But um, we 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 can do it though. Really didn't need it, but. Come here, Picky. This little Picky went to the market. This little Picky went home. And this little Picky went down an alleyway and shouldn't have. And he got shot with a crossbow. And this little Picky went rumble, rumble, rumble in my tummy. All right, uh, where am I at now? We need to go this way more. Could be just following the road, I don't know. <sighs> I know there's another pig, I don't care. The pigs only give us leather. Oh, really? Oh, maybe Gargoyle was just bored. But um bum -tsh. All right, who's got the question here? Who wants to give me something so I can get something from him? Yeah, but I said it first though. Bernard, huh? All right, come here, Bernard. Can I help you with something? I'll bring you a new bow. Fine, we got to make a new bow. Let's talk to you guy. Um, have you heard any gossip? No. Okay, fine. Be that way. Uh, we just want to talk to everyone to keep on uh, increasing. Man, I am terrible at this stuff. Nice weather. Oh, you didn't like the weather. I mean, it is winter time. Uh, how you been? Oh, you like that one? Good. Uh, how's the job? Oh, you didn't like that one. Fine. I'll go now. You don't have to tell me twice. Nice weather? Oh, you don't like that one. Either. No one likes the weather. Huh? Uh, you got a moment? How you been? Uh, you got a moment? How you been? Look at that, 100%. Uh, you got a moment? How you been? Oh, fine. What's this guy at anyways? Oh, this 100% guy, I can't even recruit him. So that, that kind of sinks. Uh, you got a moment? How you been? Uh, how you been? Uh, how you been? Well, oh, that's just simple enough. What are you? You are a three two three two two one. Yeah, yeah. All you guys stink. All right. So uh, we got to go down to Hornica. And we got to do those two. Uh, what do we have to do here? 
Uh, the trading village is the Hornico one, I think. And the missing bow, that's fine. Yep, okay. He needs a recurve bow. And then we got to go back to our town anyway. So let's go back to... Let's do this one. Have you heard of the trading village? So maybe you know. So on the hood, I see a plus um, minus 10% heat and a plus 20%. I don't know, understand the negative number and the positive number. Mean. Okay. Um, it is not implemented in the game as of yet and to my knowledge. But soon, uh, the survival ratings um, will be... Because this is what you're talking about here now. Um, the what you, your character can overheat, and when they overheat, they're gonna obviously go through more water quicker. Um, there's you know stamina is gonna be less and stuff like that. And the cold, I mean, well, you can actually freeze to death. So like if I took off my fur stuff right now, um, I would have a little icon saying that I'm cold. So and then if I don't fix it right away, it, I'll die. I'll die from the cold. So, but I don't think the everything so far has been completely entered into the game. I mean, because right now the clothing doesn't even deteriorate. It always it's always at a hundred percent. So I'm thinking that's something that's going to be also added into uh, you know as another survival type of thing. Because right now clothing is pointless, you know, pretty much. Yeah, it doesn't even sell good. I know we could have just used the unstuck here, but that's fine. What what's a, what's a good uh, what's a good walk? Not a problem. Not a problem. <coughs> I have I have very limited knowledge, but it's it's still knowledge. Um, oh wait, am I going the right way, Berta? This is west. What's west from here? That's our town. I want to go to Hornica, so we just want to go straight south from here. Let's go to Hornica, find out what they want. We might run into some wolves, who knows? So let's uh, actually load up our crossbow here while we're waiting on our stamina to come back anyways. And the route that we're taking is probably not the most preferred route. Um, I mean, there is pass path that we can take, but uh, yeah, we're just not doing that right now. This is gonna hurt. Yeah, sometimes you gotta feel pain though to make sure you're alive. You know, as the saying goes, you know, pain is pleasure. For some people, anyways, I don't know. All I know is that pain hurts. That's all I know. All right, I see another one of the big guys here. So we can take him out. Usually there's two of them over here, though, and I'm only seeing one. Oh, there's the other one. Oh, yep. There's the other one up there. Because this is wolf territory, too. Oh, maybe we need to get the wolf. Come on. Oh, come on. No one's attacking me yet. I don't know if I want to shoot. Uh, where'd the one guy go? What, did he, did he disappear behind a tree? The wolf is chasing the deer. Seriously, where did this other guy go? There's another one up there, though. Yep. Oh, we need. I know. I need a Luke Five. I got to do some killing for here first. Um, if if someone tells me where it is, I will gladly take anybody to funk it down. Someone's got to tell me where it is. Though. I don't know where it's at. What are these guys running away for? I've never had these guys run away before. And I'm really worried about this wolf here.
There we go. The wolf is no longer. Okay. Then we'll do a quick Luke 5 here. We'll load up here. Oh, we have somebody bleeding out over here, but I don't know where. I mean, you'd figure for as big as these things are, they, they shouldn't really disappear. There he is over there. I don't know if that's the same one that we shot at before or not. Yeah, it looks like it because he's bleeding. Oh, and there's another wolf. All right, well, at least we're getting some wolves in. Now watch the quest that we're going to get as a night hunt. Wow, this this wolf did some damage over here. It got two deers. That's all right. We'll we'll take all the the free leather and all that. Didn't even have to waste an arrow on him. That's a buck too. Nice. The buck stops here. Well, if you're just gonna stand there, though, why I reload? Um, yeah, okay, fine. Be that way. I really didn't want. I wasn't looking for deer, but if you're just gonna stop right in front of me, I'm gonna shoot you. I mean, I think the Funky Town, though, is right next to Electric Avenue. I think that's uh, the avenue that runs right down downtown of Funky Town. So, I'm, but I'm not positive, though. I've never been there, so I don't know. Um... Yep, okay, we're done. Uh, let's go back going south here, right? Yeah, no, a lot of good meat, even though I really don't need any meat. I have tons of meat. What are you talking about, old? They were just released yesterday, weren't they? I'm going to fall off the couch laughing. Yeah, exactly. There is actually an electric avenue near you? Cool. When the nights go out in the city... Oh, this guy didn't run away. Good. He's actually coming toward me. Hey, I need to get my point across here. I mean, as long as your electric uh, avenue isn't near like waterworks or something like that, well, then we're good. All right, I'll kill a fox. I don't care. No, no, no. You don't want to? Okay, fine. We'll go into town. I think we've we've done enough uh, damage around here. Got to get these quests before it turns nighttime. All right, who's got it? Who's got it? This way. Uh, is it you? I think it's you. No, it's not you. It is. Oh, we're stuck on our roof. We're stuck. There we go. Hey, come here. It's you. Can I help you with something? I'm really hungry. I don't care, man. Okay, what's he want for the lavish meal, though? Or lavish meal? Um, he wants flour. Of course he wants flour. Something that I can't get from here. Uh, at least I don't think I can get from here. Do you sell flour? Show me your stuff. Uh, nope. You make stuff out of flour, but you don't sell flour. All right, that means we got to go back up to Gastovia or our town and get the flour. Okay. Um... So let's see here. Let's go. Let's just start knocking off these quests here now. I think all of them are back going to be back in our town anyway. So. Oh, come on. Journal. So me. F. There we go. All right. Let's go back to our town. Uh, do another Luke 5 here. And we might just have to run back here anyways to deliver some flour. But that's all right. Now, this is going to be a long walk back home here, though. 
I know, like I said, we could use the the, the fast uh, or the unstuck button, but it's winter time and well, I mean, it, it works out good because you guys can still see in the dark and I don't have a torch on me, so. Plus, it's a good day for a walk, you know? You feel that nice, cold, uh, fresh air, you know? It's good for the lungs, right? I mean, because this has all got to be nice, pure air here. Nice and clean, no smog, you know? Eddie Grant, Electric Avenue, 1983. Exactly. Yeah, like I said, it just came out yesterday, right? I mean, this is 1980, right? Can't help it. I'm a product of the... Uh, I'm a product of the great music of, you know, of the 70s and 80s and into the early 90s. After that, music kind of got bad. I mean, there's still occasional the good song here and there. But um, to me, again, just my opinion, the best music came out in the 70s and 80s um, for pretty much all genres of music. You know. I mean, if you're a punk rock fan, you know, then yeah, the 70s and 80s were it. If you're a rock fan, 70s and 80s were it. The pop, I think the pop was better in the 70s and 80s. Country was even better in the 70s and 80s. I mean, I don't know. To me, the 70s and 80s were just better. But again, yeah, my, just my opinion. Some pretty good uh, metal. Late, yeah, late, uh, again, metal was good in the, in the 80s, yeah. So, I mean, I think even techno was better in the 80s. Rap was better in the 80s. I mean, and again, that's just my opinion. You know, maybe it's because I'm old. I don't know. I just think everything was better in the 80s. I don't need the meat, but uh, you're there. Oh, I missed the target. Oh, boy. Come on, load, 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 load. Where medieval bee might be in the room. Guess where this medieval... I think it's uh, uh, supposed to be Poland. I think, if I'm not mistaken, it's, it's um, established on a, on, a, on a Polish map. And I saw the other guy looking there. Hopefully I'm hiding behind this guy. I'm, hope, I'm hiding behind his buddy and he doesn't see me. Good he didn't see me. All right, let's keep on going. We only need to kill one. That's fine. Oh, there's another one right in front of me, too. Chris Cannell, Timeless though, Wonderful Music. Well, yeah, I mean, if you're talking about, you know, like a certain uh, group, then yeah. I mean, I, I could say the same thing about, you know, um, you know, just about any 70s and 80s artist, you know, or even the, the ones who started in the 60s. You know, I could say the same thing about, you know, Robert Plant is timeless, you know? I could say the same thing about, you know, Jimmy Page is timeless. You know, Eric Clapton is timeless. And that wolf, I just walked right by and he didn't spot me. So that means he gets shot. Anyone else around? I think he might have been munching on, oh, he was munching on something. No, when you got the 60s, I mean, you got the birth of Pink Floyd, the... Um, you know, who went all the way into the 80s before they split up. You, you got, you know, um, Zeppelin came out. Um, Grand Funk Radio, uh, Railroad, yeah. I mean, they're, they're you know, right around the corner from where, where I'm at right now. Um, we're an American band. We're an American band. Yeah. Oh, we got a wolf there. We got a wolf. I didn't. I don't know where you came from. No, I'm saying where that we where they were formed, where where they're based out of, you know. Because uh, I'm I, they're they're from Michigan, and I'm a Michigan band. I, I'm a, I'm a Michigan man. Yeah. 
See, I, I got I got their song mixed in with uh, my uh, talking there. Well, I say that there has been so much bad music since the 90s, only a few standouts. However, music from the 60s and yes, I agree. That's that's the, that's the thing. I mean, there was just and yes, there was one hit wonders from every single generation of music and all that. Oh, we understand all that, you know. There's going to be one hit wonders all the time. So My computer's not liking something right now. I must be getting a power spike or something. That's the only bad part of where I live. I live out in the country. So um, I'm prone to electrical issues every now and then. I have tons of brownouts, blackouts, all this other good stuff. But uh, I have great internet though. So... All right, where is the entrance at? Uh, I think it's this way. Yep. Are the deer going to run into my town? No. Nope. Uh, it's a solid band. They don't get much. Uh, no, I mean, you could say the same thing about CCR, you know, Canadian band, you know, Rush even. Um, they had their moment. Yep. No, I'm home. And that's what we're, we're going to do here. We're going to fill up on everything, drop off a bunch of stuff. Um, I just got to finish this quest here and then I got to stock up on stuff here. Mm. Come here, Berta. I'm back. Um, sorry, but her item's better. I always say that the other item's better just because it's worth more. I don't know why. Oh, we got to do the Berta coin, huh? Um, that's right. We got to do the trading village is our own. <laughs> so after we just insulted her we gotta go buy something from her come here I would like to buy noble boots there you go even though we could have made them and just kept the money but that's fine alright um, your dad wouldn't let you see GFR in concert he said someone would throw a brick and I'd be killed uh, oh wrong building uh, I don't know why he would say they throw a brick but um I've seen, I've seen lots of concerts, um, some good, some bad, but uh, lots of concerts. Uh, we're gonna take some buckets of milk. That's what we're gonna do, and we're gonna fill up on buckets of milk. All your friends went though. Yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, you know those those happens. I mean, that's but parents, you know. Oh, come on! I didn't want to eat the broadleaf. I want to drink milk. There we go. We're at 100. All right. Jay Giles. Oh, Jay, Jay Giles was freaking awesome. Whammer Jammer is one of my favorite songs. The harmonica that the guy did was just simply amazing. I wish that is something that I saw in concert. I never was able to see um, Jay Giles in concert because the guy died. Um... But yeah, no, I, Jay Giles was just awesome. Most of the people that I saw in concert were more of your 80s uh, bands, your Def Leppard, your um, Ugly Kid Joe, uh, Metallica, ACDC, Aerosmith. Yeah, yeah, no. I can imagine they come to Florida a lot. Um, what do I need here? I don't need anything. We just need to go to this place here. Are we done with our... No, we got to do the missing bow. That's right. We got to get a recurve bow. Recurve bow. But yeah, I, I, I mean, I can just imagine how good of a concert Jay Giles does. I mean, there's some bands like... Um, I saw the Dave Matthews Band. The Dave Matthews Band is just freaking awesome in concert uh they put on such an awesome show and i'm i'm assuming yeah yeah angel and centerfold yeah i'm assuming that jay giles is exactly the same no i mean i, I just said whammer jammer is just because that's my favorite song out of them but uh yeah um jay giles had a bunch of good songs 
I mean, when, when you've been around long enough and you can put out a greatest hits album, I think you're pretty good, you know? Again, that's just me, though. I don't know. Even though I don't think Pink Floyd ever came out with a greatest hits album. I mean, Queen had to put out a greatest hits album three times. Now, are you saying Southern Rock like in, um, are you meaning like Leonard Skinner? Um, oh, gosh. Um, drawing a blank here on uh, a bunch of other people. Um, wow, why can't I think of another Southern Rock group, man? Yeah, Almond Brothers. There we go. Almond Brothers. That was not, not that was not the that's not the group I'm thinking of though. I'm thinking of a really popular Southern rock grand. Curious, what was your very first concert you went to and what year? Uh, Molly Hatchet. There we go. Molly Hatchet. There we go. Molly Hatchet was a great Southern rock group. Um, very first concert. Um, wow. Um. It's either, I, I don't know what year it was. So, but I know it had to be before um, 1986, because I know that's the last time they went on tour. Um, and that would have been Queen. And Queen was freaking awesome. Um, and it's funny how I got to go. Uh, my parents were going, um, but, um, and they were supposed to get a babysitter for me and the babysitter, uh, canceled out in the last second. So they're just like, all right, well, let's buy it buy uh, let's just buy another ticket. And so they did. So I got to go see, uh, queen ZZ top also puts on a awesome concert. ZZ Top, I would, I mean, ZZ Top though, I don't know what, I mean, I, what would you call that? Cactus Rock? I mean, really? I mean, that's, that's about it, right? So I got the recurve bow, right? Yes. Uh, yes, I do. Okay. All right. Let's go back to this guy again now. Uh, we'll do another Luke 5. Um, I, I really wish I was able to see a kind of magic tour because um, I was older then. Um, and that would have been 1986. But um, yeah. That that would have been that would have been amazing. You know, believe it or not, um, John Cougar Mellencamp was probably a uh, one of the best concerts I ever went to. I know that sounds kind of weird, maybe, but. They did something with the Rolling Stone song. They did um, You Can't Always Get What You Want, uh, that Rolling Stone song. And uh, Cougar had a, um, a violinist. And they did the song with a violin instead of a lead guitar. And that was just, it was just so awesome there. The Recycle Tour? Yeah, that would have been late 80s, yep. Yeah, I think that's a, the tour. Yeah, because I don't think I don't know if they put an album on after that. Eagles, I never saw the Eagles. Um, I had a chance to see the Eagles, um, but I did not see the Eagles. Um, I did see Glenn Fry by himself though, but I never saw the Eagles. Here's your vote. Very right, good. See you later. Oh, that's right. I, I forgot to grab the flower. I forgot to grab the flower. Darn it. Um, I think we can buy flower. And... The, uh, well, that's Alabama, though, right? If you got to have a fiddle, you're going to play. Yeah, you got to have a fiddle if you're going to play in Texas. Yep. That, that's Alabama right there. If you're going to play in Texas, you got to have a fiddle in the band. That lead guitar is hot, but not for Louisiana, man. Do, 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 do. So rising up your bow. 
Charlie Daniels. Charlie Daniels, to me, I, this may sound bad, but it's, Charlie Daniels, to me, was a one-hit wonder. You know? Um, no, Dark Arrow, I love Alabama. Um, it's one of the very few uh, country songs or country groups that I like. So, I just think they were really gifted and they sounded really good. And they, were, they weren't your typical country. They actually, you know, wrote songs about, you know, life in America and type of thing like that. So, I like them. Had a sense to see a chance to see the Eagles before Fry died, but the tickets were like 200 for crappy seats and I wasn't going to. Yep. Yeah, when they were doing their uh, their last tour, the Eagles. Oh, yeah. they It was all, all about money. All about money. What is it? The Hell Freezes Over tour or something like that? I call them more country rock. Um, some of the songs, yes, I could see that. But um, there is lots of songs uh, that they did that are pure country. They are pure country. I would have to say they were one of the first groups that um, maybe added a little bit of pop into it. But, um, I mean, you know, they added their fiddle in a lot of those ba- a lot of those songs. And they had their trademark sound and all that good stuff, you know. They they were really good. Um, I don't think I have any flower in here, do I? No, I have fur. Not flour. Uh, we're making a bunch of wooden spoons, though. Let's uh, start selling these guys. All right. Um, we're starting to stock up again on wool. That's good. I could probably start selling some of the straw here, right? I'm just looking for stuff to sell now. Plus, we need to make um, a torch anyways. Uh, 61.45. That sounds good. Yep. I don't have any sticks. Oh, we need to fix our... We might as well fix this while we're here. Yeah, actually, no. I don't care about it. As long as it still works, we're good. Uh, what time is it? It is 2 o'clock in the morning, almost 3. All right. Um, I, I, don't, I just got rid of all my meat, dude, didn't I? Yep. I can't even sit around and cook meat. All right. Well, let's just... Um, where do I need to go? I need to go deliver that. I, I need to go talk to him because I think they sell flour. Alabama was really a crossover. I remember their pop stations in the 80s playing their music. The last time I saw them was kind of lackluster. They played melodies of their hits instead of just, just playing a session. So they tried to play every song they wrote. That's a lot of songs. You know, Alabama put out tons and tons of good music. I mean, tons of good music. Um, it was weird. Yeah, I, I can imagine. Uh, I'm just going to make a bunch of torches and sell them. I got the straw. Why not make torches? So we'll add something to do here until the people wake up and I can go buy some flour. I don't really don't feel like walking back home again just to pick up some flour. We'll just buy it. I mean, because they have slow songs, fast songs. I mean, I did like the 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 song that they did with um, oh shoot um, the last song they they kind of just did. Um, with the other, with, uh, was it Bra- uh, Paisley, Brad Paisley, uh, the, uh, the old time Alabama, uh, that, that, I like that song. That's a good, that's a good song. That, I think he did a very good job of, uh, making a tribute to Alabama. So I did like that. So that was good. I mean, it's hard for me to say who was my favorite artist, you know, band or soloist. I mean, I, I would have to lean toward Queen, but I, I would be strongly, I strongly favor uh, Pink Floyd. I strongly favor Led Zeppelin. I mean, I strongly favor Eric Clapton and all the stuff that all the groups that he was in, plus his solo work. I mean, that's what I'm saying. There's just so much good music that came out in that time period. It is hard to say which one is your your favorite. I mean, I can easily say that Alabama is my favorite country artist. I can say that. Um, 
but as far as like rock goes, I mean, yeah, it's, it's be kind of hard to uh, name just one, one person or group. I mean, cause like I, I can listen to ACDC all, all day long too. I mean, it's, but you know, there's days where I'm like, nope, it's more of a Pink Floyd day or nope, it's a, it's a more of a Aerosmith day or it's more of a, you know, Floyd day or it's more of a Clapton day. You know, it's, I mean, it's, <laughs> there's just so much good music out there. I don't even know how many I can make now. Uh, I don't. I don't want that. Oh, come on. I want this. I want that. I can make what? One hundred and one hundred twenty-two of them. Yeah, this is gonna take a while. Oh, and they take five seconds each. Holy cow! All right. Well, this is a perfect time to uh, tell me what you guys see while we while we make this and wait for morning. All right. Oh. Uh, the tribute band called Aussie Pink Floyd. I've heard of Brit Floyd. My son came home from work and he told me about this great band he heard at work. It was Journey. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. I love, I love it when kids do that. Hey, have you heard of this new group? I think it's called Journey. They have this song that says, you know, it's like, don't stop believing. It's awesome. But yeah. <laughs> There's some weird sounds here coming from making these torches. You're in the middle of a commercial? Oh, is it the, the song was in, a, in the middle of a commercial? Oh, you actually had a commercial, huh? Yeah, I don't know who sees them and who doesn't, so. We still got a lot to make. But yeah, Journey. Journey's another great uh, band from the 70s and 80s, you know. Don't Stop Believing, Faithfully, you know. Why is my weight going up though? It should be going down. I guess uh, torches weigh more than sticks. Saw the Aussie Pink Floyd on PBS a few years back, and then it came to the Twin Cities and got tickets. Uh, to, and got tickets. An awesome tribute band. Heard later they got an invite to play one of the original Pink Floyd members' birthday. Wow, that's kind of cool. Yeah, I've never heard. I mean, I like I said, I've heard of Brit Floyd, uh, B R I T, Brit um, Floyd, but I, I've never heard of. I don't know. That could be the same group. I don't know. Um, you waited all day just in the rain. Yeah, I, I always just I, I always went to the uh, ticket uh, Ticketmaster areas or whatever was you know selling tickets at that time, and did it. We never had to wait outside though. It was always uh, like inside of a mall or something. So. Now it's all done online and, you know, it, a show sells out in 10 minutes. So all right, I think that's enough. Uh, I didn't realize that my weight would be going up. Oh, I know that. All right. Um, is it still morning time? Eh, it's six o'clock. They should be waking up soon. Let's put it on auto walk here. As we just walk slow. Too bad we can't walk and craft at the same time. That'd be kind of neat. All 
I'm hoping that we can buy flour here. If not, well, we are we we will have to go home. I don't I don't I can't remember where I can buy flour at. I think it's here though. All right, some people are out and moving around. That's good. good. That's what I'm thinking too. Um, it was either her or um, the guy who took over. Oh, and they're both in the tavern. Nice. Well, let's just go in the tavern here. We'll put our crossbow away. We don't need it right now. Adelina. Show me your stuff. Oh, you have flour. Good. We need four flour. Uh, so, yeah, we'll buy 24. Uh, actually, no, we'll buy we'll buy 43 flour. That, that's close enough, right? All right. We got a, we got a bunch of torches we can sell. Um. I uh, got a fur hood we can sell. Um, I got a stone I could sell. I mean, I could sell all the straw here that I grab, plus all the sticks. Oh, let's sell the spoons first, though. Um, all right, so we got our flour. We're good. I'll go now. See you later. All right, now we can go deliver the flour. You just got to get out of this town. All right. And now the long walk continues here. Uh, let's grab our crossbow again and get it like, get it all loaded up here. All right. And then we just got to figure out what are we going to do for the rest of the season here? I mean, what is our skills at here? Um, our hunting skill is, yeah, I mean, I don't know. We've done a lot of killing, and we just are not getting up on the points here. We need to get, we need to get higher. I mean, I guess I could put my traps out again. I haven't put my traps out in forever. Because I, I don't need the meat, but, I mean, I guess in, in one way, it's also a good way of getting fur and leather and feathers. And, you know, but, I mean, who wants to eat rat meat all the time, though? Yeah, now would probably be a good time to do a Luke 5. There we go. Time is on my side. Yes, it is. Doo, doo, doo. One of the events that I had was a hunter and gave me 500 XP. Nice. That way, I kind of need that right now. I need like, um, let's see here. Uh, yes, I am. Uh, tomorrow is um, Community Fun Day. Tomorrow is where we're going to do um, Jackbox again. And, um, you know, uh, might do Among Us. Um, so what we'll probably start it off as stream, uh, stream racers until everyone kind of fills in. And then as soon as everyone's in, then yeah, we'll do a uh, Jackbox and, um, I think we're going to do among us this time. So, uh, what time, um, it probably be, I'm going to guess not knowing exactly where you're at. Uh, roughly two and a half hours before this time, whatever current time it is right now, whatever two and a half hours earlier is. So that would be roughly four o'clock Eastern Standard Time. So it would be the starting point between four and four thirty Eastern Eastern Standard Time. So again, I don't know what time that would be for you, but you know, I'm sure you guys can do the math. But yeah, four o'clock Eastern Standard Time. On most Sundays is when we'll start. Um, we'll probably run it for about like four hours, three and a half to four hours, somewhere in that time frame. 
Uh, so, you know, all depends on if GG stream tomorrow to the time you might stream. I might be in and out. Oh, not a problem. Not a problem. Hey, um, Gargoyle and I have a perfect understanding with each other. You know, we um, normally don't try to interfere with each other's stream times. Uh, but the weekends are pretty much all, uh, you know, they're free game. So, because not everyone streams on a weekend. So, but uh, yeah, no, if he's streaming on a Tuesday or Thursday, yeah, you won't find me streaming. So, just in, I mean, I know he'll tell you, hey, if I'm streaming, go watch him. And I'll tell you if, if he's streaming while I'm streaming, I'll, I'll tell you, go watch him. You know? So, I mean, yeah, no, we have a lot of, uh, a lot of respect for one another. So, Here you go. Here's your food. And you only gave me 16 rep. Man, it's taking forever. Man, we haven't even got to the, we haven't even got past the 12,000. Uh, actually, do I have any workers here? Are they all still mothers? Oh, we do have a worker. Oh, look at that. I have one worker. Two, just tons and tons of kids here though. All right, what are you going to do? We need to find you a job. You are, you need to find a job. What do we want to use you as? Uh, we do have to go home and fix everything here because it looks like a lot of stuff is uh, damaged. Um, okay, uh, we could put you down in the tavern. Um, that actually would probably make sense to put you down as a tavern person and have you make more, um, make more food. I know, I know. But I like, I, you know, like, like I tell everyone, um, you know, when people ask me, hey, what time I'm streaming and, and if I'm in a different stream, I'm like, hey, you know, look, you know, that's fine and dandy. But, you know, I'm, I'm here to enjoy, you know, this person here. We don't need to talk about. Yeah, I didn't do these quests up here. Seriously, was there just more than one quest? Wow. Maybe I just didn't do them. Hmm. Yeah, there's no more quests going on. Hmm. Maybe we just got a bunch of quests today. Uh, let's use our unstuck then. And let's go back up here to Bronica and Branica. All right, north. Man, I thought we got all the, all the quests. Guess we didn't, though. I mean, look at this scenery, though. This scenery is awesome in the wintertime. You're coming up on the hill here, and you see the, the water. You see the towns. I mean, this right here is just, it's amazing. You know, this is so beautiful here. They did such a good job on, on these graphics here. Such a good job. It's just blows me away. And it's, you don't have to like wait for it to render in or something like that. No, you get to see everything. That's just, it's so, so beautiful. One of these days I'll clean up this tree that I knocked down and just left it there. Maybe, I don't know. At least I always know if I ever need a tree, there's a tree there. I probably did that right in the beginning of the game when I was always just cutting stuff down and making spears or hammers or whatever to sell. I'm going to have to get some food here pretty soon. And I don't have any more straw, so I can't make any torches, so I can't make a campfire. So, uh, we are going to go down here and go grab some straw so we can make a torch. All right, and come on. That should be enough sticks here. All right, and there's a good, should be a good patch of straw uh, right around this bend here, if I remember correctly. Uh, nope, it's past the other bridge. See, I don't remember correctly. We're just picking up as we run by here. Whatever we pick up, we pick up. Except rocks. I'm trying to not to pick up rocks. I don't even know how much meat I have. I think I only killed the one animal. But we'll kill a bunch on the way. There we go. Here's the straw. 
clack, clack, clack. You know, usually the winter time, I, I usually try to grab everything and sell it too. So maybe we'll, we can do that too. Um, I should have enough to make a torch now. Yep. Okay, I'm gonna have to grab one more just in case uh, we need to make two torches. There we go. All right, and uh, let's go, where are we at here? We need to go straight north from here. Let's get our bow ready and we'll just kill everything that comes along our way. I like this guy over here. He's not in our path, but you know, well, he's big and I want to kill him. Plus, I think he's right near the town. It's been a while since we killed a bear, actually. That was a weird animation there. Um, is that the town I want? It is the town I want. Nice. All right, let's go find uh, what other quest we have available today. So it looks like we're going to be doing a lot of more running around. Like I said, uh, hopefully it's not a night hunt. I just don't like the night hunts. I think they're just more of a waste of time than anything. Um, but it's a quest and we'll do it if we get it. Come on. She's not interested in talking to me. What the heck? Why? She has a quest. Stop. Hey, I'm talking to you, woman. Seriously, are you going to bed? Okay, that was weird. Okay, yep. Um, I need food. All right, the food went missing. Okay, what does she want? Two berries and seven meat. All right, now I will have to go back home and we'll get the berries. Is it just me? But after the latest update, there seems to be less animals in the game. Um, I think there's always less animals in the game. Um... To me, anyways, um, it seems like there's always, um, I'm going the wrong way again. Um, I think the, I think the deer, there was too many deer to begin with. Uh, now the deer are a little, are a little rare. So, which is good. I, I, I don't like as many deer. Um, but all the other animals, I mean, it does appear to be that way, but it could be that we're just, we know where they're at and we're, you know, we just naturally avoid those areas. I don't know. But it's hard to say. Geronimo! Come on, jump the fence. All right, who has got the quest here? Oh, it's you that has the quest. What do you want me to do? Can I help you? Uh, you need wool. I'll get the wool for you. Well, I wish I would have done that quest first. Yeah, yeah, I know. I know we need to eat. Um, that's why I made sure I have a torch on me. All right, well, this town over here has wool, so we'll just go over here and buy the wool. Too bad it's not summertime, or I'll just grab some berries here. But we're going to have to go back home to get the berries. I'm thinking about maybe possibly we could just go home and drink some more milk. That way we'd have some bunch more uh, buckets. That way when we need them for water, it'll be it'll be much better. All 
because I do want to make just a ton of uh, tarts or bread or whatever, whatever we need to make. Wait, no, I don't want to go to you. I want to find the person who sells stuff. You have the quest. I already got the quest, though. I don't have anything to give you yet. Who's the seller? Who's who's buying my stuff? Uh, Norbert, show me your stuff. You got wool. Ah, uh, you got a bunch of wool too. Wow. All right, we are definitely gonna have to sell some stuff here because I'm just buying everything here. But I mean, it's fine. All right, we got wool now. Let's go back. Uh, get that quest active here. All right, and then we'll go back home. Go grab some berries. Uh, we could probably. Uh, look to see what we can sell here too when we go back we got to start selling some stuff here we desperately need it and we should have enough food to make it all the way back to if not that's fine we'll just make a quick campfire that's why i made sure we got the torches and we have a little bit of meat on us and i mean she's just going to give us a uh uh, reward of probably wool thread. Um, have you heard? Heard you have a bunch of tarts coming to your village? Oh, no. What's up, Truman? How you doing? Incoming. We might get a raid soon. That's fine. Here's your wool. Yay. All right, let's go home. Let's go get some berries. Well, that was a short stream then. If uh, if I'm guessing I'm getting raided by Gargoyle. That was a short stream by him. You're watching GG all day? Yeah, I watched. Uh, I was in there for the first part. A little bit of the first part. Come on, computer. That's his third stream today? Holy cow. He's been busy today then. I only saw one of them. He's done five hours so far. Wow. Yeah, only yeah, only two. That's what I thought. He's only done two. Yeah, I never got the notification for a second one, which was kind of weird. That's why I I, I started streaming. Oh, that buck came out of nowhere. All right, let's get this fox here. Come here, Mr. Fox. There. All right. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. This is one reason why I would like a chair. I actually, actually sit right. All right. He never really shut down, did some eating, some over 500 food making. Wow. So he did lots and lots of crafting today. Now uh, we don't need water, so we can actually take the bridge. Let's actually walk across the bridge, you know? I mean, they do have bridges here for a reason, right? I want to put torches on both on both both sides of these bridge, though. I think it'd be kind of cool. Here. All right. Um, I don't need uh, the flower goes in the food storage. Fur, get rid of. Leather, get rid of. Sticks, get rid of. Straw, get rid of. Wool, get rid of. Wool thread. There we go. How much now? How much wool do we have? 370 wool. Yep. Okay. We're getting up there. We're getting up there with wool. So that's good. That is good. All right. Yeah. And actually, we need to find stuff that we can sell here. So let's grab our arrows. You're in? What do you, what do you mean you're in? I mean, you've been here the whole time. Um, you're, you're full time now? All right. There's still more flack too. Wow. Oh wait, no, that's the stuff that we gotta spin. 
Well, hello there, Sailor Rachel. How you doing? Glad to have you here. I hopped over from the Gargoyle stream. Nice, nice, nice. Yep, hopefully um, I can, uh, you know, give you somewhat of a sliver of the entertainment that Gargoyle does, you know. So I doubt it, but you, you never know. You never know. You know, you, you're going to get low quality uh, uh, entertainment over here. So, but glad to, glad to have you here. Hopefully you're having a great day. All right, we'll put, oh wait, I need the meat to sell. That's right. Uh, we need some berries here. So uh, yeah, we'll grab a uh, half of them or something. Ah, like, yeah, 269 sounds good. <laughs> thank you, Luke. Thank you. And thank you for the follow there, Sailor. Or should, you, should I just call you Rachel? I don't know. I also slid over from GD Stream. Hope you and everyone is doing great. Um, yeah, I think everyone in the chat is doing um, okay. Uh, the ones that I haven't put to sleep anyways yet, I don't know. Um, you know, I, I do have that tendency of putting people to sleep. So, you know. Thank you very much for the follow there also. Uh, I don't need all this flour. Uh, oh, I don't need any of the flour, right? We already delivered the flour. And I'm overweight. What else can we get rid of? I don't need, I need, I need the meat. Um, yeah, we'll get rid of the, uh, we'll get rid of some of these. And speaking of the GG man himself, there he is, the one and only, the Gaming Gargoyle. I don't know why I did it like an announcer version of that, but hey, that's kind of cool. <laughs> Exactly, exactly, Truman. All right, uh, let's go turn in. <laughs> hey, oh, again, everybody. Yes, we just jumped from one stream to another stream. Um, Gargoyle, I'm sorry, I didn't, I did not receive the notification that you were on again. Um, so I know it's all good on your end, but um, hopefully you had a uh, great uh, second stream there. So I know some of the people here were uh, bouncing back and forth from your stream to my stream. So uh, how many houses I have? Uh, I don't know. I'm at, I'm at, I, I know I have um, full thingamabobbers here, but uh, management houses. Let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 10, 11, 12, 13. Yeah, I don't know how to count here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen houses. Yep, fifteen houses. Um yep, you can watch both streams simultaneously, that's true. Yeah, numbers are hard. I, you know. I mean, next you're going to ask me to divide two to get you one, you know? I mean, come on. But no, thank you very much for uh, the people that were dual uh, watching. That's awesome. Can you do that, please? No, I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't do it. I just can't do it, man. I just can't. Or basically, I just don't want to. I think that's what uh, what the main thing is. I just don't want to. <laughs> you know, I'll just be honest. I just don't want to. Oh, that's right. I never grabbed anything to eat. Oh, my gosh. Uh, well, let's uh, hurry up and go uh, get rid of this meat, and then we'll cook our food here. Yes. The The command is exclamation point eat there, Luke. And that would it would have popped up. Yeah, I mean, if I had 50 cents for every time I failed the math test, I think I'd have $7.83. There are two things I never asked you to do. Do math, drive anything. <laughs> thank you very much. Thank you, thank you very much. I mean, some people would want me to do math while driving. And that would just not be good. That wouldn't be good at all. All right, come on. Let's just... Uh, Turn in this uh, quest here and then go sell some stuff here. Yeah, I made sure I grabbed food so I can sell, but I never grabbed any food. Yeah, and they have a death wish. Exactly. There you go. 
Yay. All right, anyone out here want to buy some stuff? Huh? Huh? Anybody? Anybody? Who wants to buy some stuff? Oh, I got it. I got it. All right. Um, it's you over here, right? What's your name again? Uh, Norbert. Norbert, show me your wares. You are going to buy some iron arrows that our people have been strongly, strongly making. Oh, look at that. You had a bunch too. And we'll sell some of these berries here. Um, all right. And I have 13 meat. So we're, let's go cook that meat and let's go eat it here. Uh, where am I at here? I am here. So let's just go west and go uh, sell some stuff along all these towns here. There we go. Now the heist are starting. Now we're, now we're talking here. Everybody wants bones money. Uh, more than likely, Sailor Rachel, you do not have any points because uh, you just got here. Uh, if you want to just type in exclamation point points and I'll tell you how many points you have. Uh, but someone might be nice and give you some points. Uh, but yeah, more than likely, you don't have any points. Oh, we don't. I, I need I need sticks. I just I sold everything or I dropped them. That's right. Yeah, true man could use some points, you know, for all those that are feeling generous today. Oh wow, True Man's going all in. He, that's that's gambling right there. Hey, it's go big or go home, right? I mean, I mean, that's what the saying is, right? Ah, uh, you got to spell it right though, Luke. Yep, no, no problem, no problem. Under understood. There we go. Now we can cook some stuff here. Let's cook some meat and eat it. Oh, look at that. And Luke won more points, too. So he's got plenty of points. There you go. Yep, there's heist, there's gambling, there's eight ball. Um, like I said, the slots should be working, uh, but sometimes they just don't seem like they work ever. I don't know why. But yeah. Uh, yep, you spelled that wrong again, Luke. Oh, and we're done. We're done cooking. All right. Um, inventory, uh, meat, 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 roasted meat. Here we go. Let's eat some. There we go. 78. Sounds good. All right. Now we're going into this town here. I was surprised we were able. Words, numbers. You feel like AO Mike just robbed it? Yep. Yeah. yeah, Mike has so many points, though. Uh, he got in a, such a lucky um, run. Uh, sell some berries here. Okay. Um, is there anyone else who wants to buy over here? Or is there just one over here? I can't remember. I think most of these towns just have one. Yeah, it's twenty. Basically, yes, you you are exactly right. It's twenty twenty. Everything is forgiven. I I think so. He's also a hacker. Yes, he's he's actually a Russian spy. So yeah, he, he's probably a hacker. All right, let's go to Raymond Town here. See, there you go. You got points now, Rachel. Don't spend them all in one spot. Yeah, Luke still has plenty. You were close to 100,000 there before you, you gave some points away. Female Russian spy. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Sorry sorry about that. I forgot. Yes, he's a female Russian spy. Uh, you know, Mike's not even here to defend himself. But, yes, we're now going to be calling Mike the female Russian spy. I, I think I think that's right. Uh, yeah, he got him. He got him, Luke. I, I saw the, I saw the uh, thing. Actually, no. Hmm. 
Oh no, that's right, Luke. You you spelled that wrong. You um you put I gave instead of just give. You put I give. So yeah, you 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 spelled that one wrong too. Uh, show me your stuff, man. Yeah, some of these guys haven't been in here for a while either, so. There you go. Now it works. Um, you have two. Boom. There we go. Oh, man, you just gambled it all. It's a good thing there's a max, right? All right, let's go up to this town here and hurry up and sell here. We'll get something to drink as we cross the river. <laughs> you need to win now, yeah. No, my day, afternoon, evening, overnight job limits my viewing times. <laughs> yep. Anyone need some clay? There's some clay right here. I don't need to kill any of these deer. I'm fine. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up the traps again. Even though I don't need them. I don't need them for the money. Exactly. Over the river and through the woods to the vendor's house we go. Yo ho ho. Go to overnights on Mondays. Not looking forward to it. Ah, oh, that kind of sucks. But hey, I mean, you're still one of the fortunate ones who have a job. So that's one way of looking at it. And it's always a good way of looking at it this year. So I know that's what I'm fortunate of doing. Hey, come here, guys. You're walking away. I want to sell you something. Can't you see I want your money? I want it all. I want it all. I want it all. All right. Uh, is it you? Yes, it is you. Show me your stuff. All right. Um... I should have been selling the stuff that expires first instead of the iron arrows since they don't expire, but that's all right. Again, if like if all this stuff expires, it's fine. We'll just we'll have a bunch of fertilizer. My wife and I are very fortunate to have jobs that allow us to continue working. That is sweet. That is sweet. Oh yes, yes, yes. I, I remember what your job is, but I mean, you know, I, I try to look look things on the bright side, you know. Uh let's just go straight south and go to Lesnica, I guess. Let's just keep on selling stuff. Uh, what time of the day is it? It's uh, I'm not going to get there before it is a shame. Yes, it is a shame that Mike's not here, but, you know, uh, he likes to do a lot of uh, fun times with, uh, you know, with his family on the on the Saturdays or on the weekends. That's, but sometimes he streams on Saturday morning, but. Um, But no, yesterday, like I was saying, I had my daughter's 16th uh, birthday party here. She had a bunch of her friends. And they all stayed overnight. So yes, I had a bunch of teenage girls in my house. Um, and yeah, um, that just it wasn't fun. Um, it's not what it was all cracked up to be. But uh, it was it was they still had a blast. Um, so that worked out really good. But yeah. Um, Oh, yes, it was Giggle Central, uh, loud music, um, tons of movies that no one was watching. So, uh, no, no, no makeup party. I mean, that, that's that's younger. Not when they're 16. I mean, they're all, you know, they're all talking about boys and stuff like that. So, you know, here I was, you know, I thought I was doing something cool. I said I had a nice bonfire and all that going and nope, they're all inside listening to music and watching, watching movies. I'm like, Hey, you know, I, we, you know, I can, we can do this all outside. <sighs> TV is always on at my house and no one's ever watching it. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, I hear you there. Yep. But I mean, they all had fun. So I, I'm, I'm, I'm good with it. So And now she's doing a party today with her mom's side of the family. So, yeah, it's party, party, parties. So, 
But hey, it all works out. Like I said, everyone had fun, so I'm I'm comfortable with it. Everyone had fun. No you know, two main important things there. All right. I don't think anyone's going to be awake, but we, we, they might be awake. I don't know. I think they go to bed at eight o'clock. Yeah. And it's eight 30 right now. So that's going to be bad, but they might be in the tavern. Maybe. If not, we're just going to have to kill time here until they wake up again. We really don't have anything to do. So, oh, that's right. There is no tavern in this town. Oh, but there's a bunch of people by the fire. We can talk to them. Oh, hey, come here. Come here. Oh, look at that. I got you. I found you. There we go. I took all your money. That's the best part of it when no one gets in trouble or hurt. Exactly. That's that's what I like. No one no one had to be called and say, hey, this person did something or this person got sick or you know, this person got injured or something like that. So I'm I'm all for it. <clears throat> I told them though, all the single moms, they were allowed to stay too, but none of them took me up on the offer, so I don't know why. All right, um, that's everything we can sell. And we're back up to 11,000 coins, so that'd be good. All right, so now we can go back home. Look at that. That's pretty sweet. Now we can go back home and we can just, we can craft a bunch ourselves. Is it hard to stream on, is it hard to stream on Twitch? I stream on YouTube under my YouTube name. Uh, I stream on both. Um, you know, to me, YouTube is always, it's, to, in my opinion, Twitch is more, for live stream, YouTube is more for content videos type of thing. Um, but I mean, I know there's people who do live streams on YouTube. Like, you know, I'm one of them, Gargoyle is one of them and all that. I think it just depends on where your audience is. Um, you know, like if you're going to stream on, on Twitch, make sure you tell your YouTube audience that, hey, you're streaming on Twitch. Or it's either that or you're going to have to build up an audience. Um like, I mean, I had to do that, you know, when I went to, I stream on YouTube. But the nice thing about it is, is for, for like me, I'm in this awesome, awesome, awesome group. And we all support each other. Yes, exactly, Gargoyle. So I, that's why I think um, it really differs what you are. Some people only stream live on YouTube. So... But to me, YouTube is more about the content um, versus a live stream. You know, I'll watch up to like an hour long video on YouTube. Um, but I don't plan on staying on YouTube for hours on end where on Twitch, you know, it seems different because Twitch is nothing but live. I mean, yes, you can go back and watch old Twitch videos, but... I don't know anybody who does that. And I think it's all about the interaction. I am too, but I have no streams here. So I was just curious. Yeah, I mean, like I said, I mean, that's just my opinion. I mean, like I, I, I do, like everything that I do on Twitch, I, I throw it onto YouTube uh, as a video. So, but when I stream on YouTube, it stays on YouTube. I don't throw it on Twitch. So I think it, you know, I think that's kind of what it is. So, but yes, I mean, like my numbers are always better on Twitch than they are on YouTube. So, yeah, I I, I know you stream on YouTube. I, 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 I know what you meant. I used to only watch YouTube until I was introduced to Twitch. Yeah, I mean, some people are YouTube only. Some people are Twitch only. Some people are both. I mean, it's, it, it's, it's kind of weird. Uh, I only create videos on YouTube. I've uh, been trying to figure out home life and to be able to stream. I'm just, I am wanting to stream. Just too much noise in the house. Uh, yeah, that's that's one thing. I mean, like usually, I mean, my streaming area, um, I have my own little uh, office in the basement. Uh, but it, it's not soundproof. It's just, it's, it, it's enclosed. It's a, you know, it's an office that I converted into a streaming room. You know, it's got all my setups and, you know, my lighting and all that stuff like that. But I, I don't have the camera on it for this game. But um, I was hoping I could get on yesterday, but um, my daughter's bedroom is right above this. 
So yeah, I just, I couldn't do it. it was, there was too much noise coming from the surroundings and all the laughing and giggling and music and all that. And I mean, I still stayed down in the basement and tried to stay out of their way and, you know, let them all have their fun and everything. And, you know, occasionally I would go upstairs and check on them and stuff like that. But I mean, yeah. Now, if I was doing, I, I thought about just doing a fun stream type of thing, but um, where I could play games and they could join if they wanted to. But I'm like, no, it's, if she wanted that, she could, she would, she would ask for that. So, and I just, well, I thought about doing this. Uh, I mean, I do have um, panels above me in, in this room. Um, but they're not, they're not acoustic panels. And so maybe that's what I'll do is I'll, I'll try to soundproof more of my room. Cause I mean, I don't think it's that bad where you hear my furnace kick on because you know, my, the, you know, it, it, the sound doesn't get through the drywall and stuff like that. So, but the, the sound coming from upstairs, the other thing is, yeah, you stream out of your bedroom. Yeah. I mean, well, I mean, um, if you can soundproof in any other way, um, I think that would be really good. Uh, if, if you can do that, I mean, if you can't, you're kind of SOL, but, um, we're going to craft some wool here while we're just talking and all that. But, um, wool, 39 wool. That's all, oh, man. Uh, I hardly hear anything else from bone stream. Well, that's good. That's good. I mean, that's what I want. I want a nice quiet stream where the only thing you hear is, um, the game and, you know, occasionally me when I decide to talk. So, I mean, that's one thing though. You got to remember though, too, for you guys that, um, want to be streamers. Um, I mean, silence kills you, man. Silence straight up kills you. I mean, you got to talk about anything. Try to just make up stuff. You just built Tavern Three. Notice they added the beer one. Yep, yep, yep. Those are already in there. So um, I'm hoping that we're gonna get those uh, in there soon. And I'm liking that we have animation here on the spinning wheel now. So that's good. I mean, I'm thinking that would be the next uh, thing. Was set up in your den game room. I will actually build a separate area in that room to have my own space to record a stream while family is home. Um. I don't know if you have to do that. I mean, like Gargoyle, I think he streams in his um, his living room pretty much. So it's just, you know, getting to a point to where you can do it, um, to where it's, you're not distracted by other sounds. I don't know if you need to build your own, you know, room or something like that. Um, I mean, because really you don't need that big of a space. I mean... If you position everything right, you could probably do it in a closet. I mean, you you might feel a little cramped in there, but you could probably do it in a closet. So, I mean, then you could be a closet streamer. Who knows? You know, I don't know. And then, you know, every day when you get, when you, when you get done streaming, you're like, I'm coming out. You know, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, see, I'm just making stuff up as I go along here. You know, this is the part where, you know, you just, you just try to be, you just try to go. Exactly. I mean, you know, I don't know. You know, I'm just, you know, like I just said, I'm just, I just make things up as I go along here, you know. <laughs> don't listen to me. I, I, I don't know what I'm saying. People know this already. They, they don't pay attention to what I say. They're just hearing blah, 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 you know. They're just watching the game. <laughs> Every now and then I might say something funny. Maybe just put the desk away from the wall so your background won't be people running around. Yeah, I mean, that's fine too. And just, you know, like right now, I don't I don't have a camera on. So you stream very late so I don't bother the family and there's less noise. There you go too. I mean, there's, yeah, there you go. You'd have to change my channel name to Closet Streamer. See, I mean, there's, I, I just gave you a bunch of ideas. You know, trademark, uh, trademark Bone 13, you know, come on. <laughs> you know? Yeah, I mean, I've gone with no cam since this game's gone out. And actually, my numbers have greatly improved. Um, I, I mean, I, I think it's more of the game than just having a picture of me. But, you know, I did re I did receive comments before on YouTube. Hey, like, you know, do this with the cam, do this with the cam and all that. But now I don't hear any of that stuff. All I hear on this stream is the classic parents talking on old cartoons. Wow, wow. Exactly. Yeah. Wow, 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 wow. Charlie Brown teacher. Yep. 
It, it could possibly be Luke. It could possibly be. I mean, even though I did get a lot of females uh, when, you know, when I, I did have the face cam up. But uh, yeah, the females have kind of gone away now. So I don't know where they went. <laughs> but no. No, this game has done wonders for everything. So not planning on using a cam. I'm more worried about the noise, house full of boys and all the hardwood floors. That's what I have is all hardwood floors. So yeah, the the noise does not get muffled at all. There's no there's no carpet padding to muffle the sound. It's 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 always loud. So Well see, there you go. I got one. Woohoo! Yeah, I, 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 I never know, true man. I never know. Yeah, and there's some other awesome content creators uh, for those of you that are new to me or Gargoyle. There's a bunch of other um, good. I, I, I know there's females in here, Gargoyle. I know, I know. Yeah, and, and Danny, yeah, exactly, you know. <laughs> See, again, now I've just inserted my, um, I've inserted my foot into my mouth because now I've, I've dug a hole and I, I don't know how to get out of it. <laughs> Maybe I'm just looking for a reason to build my own closet. <laughs> See, there you go. You know, come on. Closet streamer. Trademark. Bone 13. <laughs> But yes, for those of you that are joining in late here too, tomorrow, uh, around uh, uh, 1600 or 4 p.m. Uh, Eastern Standard Time, um, tomorrow is um, a day that uh, we've kind of just started and it's a community fun day where we will do um, Jackbox, Among Us, uh, stream racer, all those other, you know, community style games. So where you can just sit back and relax. So if you guys want to partake in that tomorrow, uh, starting around, uh, 1600, uh, or 4 PM, uh, hours, um, you can come in and join. So, uh, you don't have to buy anything. Um, everything runs off of your computer or your phone. So yes. Your neighborhood, yeah, exactly. You know, got got to got to throw got to throw the trademark in there, right? Save. You gotta do exclamation point save. There should be um, commands for um, saving, eating, and drinking. So if you ever want me to do something, just type in exclamation point save. See, look at that. Save, or else you will die. All right, fine. We'll save. <laughs> yep. Uh, I would just went in the wrong one. I just drank. You don't need to just, now you're just showing them off here. Uh, should I keep all resources in the resource building for all crafting or at each place? Um, if you're doing the crafting, keep them in the place that they're, uh, that you're doing the crafting. If you have AIs doing the crafting, um, you have to keep it in the resource storage or else they won't get, they won't, they won't get, uh, get it. So uh, we're going to take this bucket of milk here. Uh, 12 buckets of milk. That sounds good. Or did I grab, well, I grabbed milk. Okay. Um, and we're doing this only because we want to empty them out. We don't need the fluid, but it has been a great stream. Glad to make you have a good night and happy hunting. All right. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you for the follow there also. Always great to have uh, new people in here. All right, and we are now Phil. And actually, uh, I'm probably going to be ending this stream here pretty soon myself. Um, we've been going for over two hours here, and i got to go pick up my son in a little bit. So um, I don't want to get caught on something here and just forget about him. So, all right, uh, we, we finished all that. Um, I got 11 more buckets. Nice. And I don't know if any of our normal people are streaming or not. So I don't know if there's anybody that we can raid. We might have to go find a new person again, which is not a big deal. 
we like finding new people and uh, just expanding our community out. Uh, nope, you're a little off, but you're close. So, but yeah, I have to get off in about uh, 15 more minutes. So that'd be the longest I could go. Uh, what am I doing now? We got to craft something here. We got to find something to do. Uh, I did just buy a lot of, uh, I had to stop making potash, potash twice because my character ran out of both water and food. During, what? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You must have been making a lot then. Holy cow. If you had to stop twice. Wow. Uh, yeah, I don't have any other. I do have meat. Um, I don't know if there's anything I can cook really. Um... I do have the flour. We have 64 flour. I mean, we could be making... Uh... All right. No problem, Danny. Thanks a lot. Uh, what do we need to make a roasted uh, tart? A tart, a tart, a tart. We need 10 flour. So, wow, we can only make uh, six of them, huh? And I don't have any onions, though. That's right. I don't have any onions. So I cannot make those. All right. Um, but we can stock up on our mushrooms again here. No one's calling anyone a tart. Uh, I got to get rid of all these mushrooms here. And we'll just wait until morning here. I guess we'll sell these over at uh, Gustovia. I think that's about the only place left we can go to to sell. Um... Oh, not a problem, not a problem, Rachel. Everyone is always welcomed here, except for me. I'm not welcomed anyway. All right, do we just grab our eggs? I mean, why not, right? We have 100, we have 238 eggs there. And then we're overweight. All right, uh, no problem. We'll just be a little overweight. It's not much. Well, that's what you like. I don't know. I don't know about you. I don't know about me, though. I don't know what I like anymore. All right. Well, let's start going to... Oh, we need to go to Denica. Um, yeah, it's 2 o'clock in the morning. We can go to Denica. Maybe by the time we walk over there, the people will be awake. And I'm going the wrong way to Denica. Well, let's go the right direction here, people. But yeah, we, I got all the wool. Oh, when I just made all, I made it all in the wool thread. Darn it, I just screwed up. I wanted to make, I needed wool thread so I can make more lanterns. And I just converted it all into wool cloth. Uh, no, um, the only thing that needs to be in the food building is food. So anything that you would like make in the tavern. All tavern stuff needs to be in the food chest. Um, all other things need to be in the resource chest. But your farmers don't require anything at all um, as of yet. They don't need anything. So you could put it anywhere. They're not going to grab anything. Your farmers, um, are, they, they farm by magic and they don't ever use any resources. You don't need seeds. You don't need um, hose or size or bags or anything like that. So farming is all done by magic. You can never decide what to stream. That's your biggest problem. Yeah, uh, getting a schedule is um, unique. Um, it is a challenge. Uh, yeah, they'll, they'll put it there. Sent a recommendation in the Discord. Um, in my Discord? Uh, no, that's um. I have a I I have power issues. That's uh my power supply going crazy. Well, thank you very much for the raid there, Flint. Welcome aboard, all you raiders. Glad you could be here, Flint. Your problem is that you don't stream enough. I mean, it's 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 
it, it is it, do, it takes a little bit of uh self-discipline what's up flint how you doing i'm doing well i know i don't need this but uh what were you just streaming Come on, come on, come on. And uh, this town is just too close. We need to kill somebody. Uh, it's 341. We need to kill something. Um, do I have any? I only have, I have five meat. Um, we grab some sticks here and let's cook it up at least. All right, and let's cook. Now, like I said, I only got five, not a lot. It was cool. What were you streaming, though? Um, oh, Little Big Workshop? Okay, I don't know that one. What is that one? Just relaxing, basically? That's fine. That's all all streams should be, right? Just Just relaxing? All right, um, there's a pig. I'm gonna go shoot a pig over here. Come here, Mr. Piggy. Oh, there's two pigs. One little piggy's down. I'm just worried about if there's a wolf out here. Do a nice Luke five. Um, nope. And now we're just getting more stuff that makes us more overweight. This is the problem of waiting for these vendors to open up. Uh, Bone is actually a comic book character uh, named Bone. Uh, if you look up Bone comic, uh, you'll see a bunch of other stuff there. But yeah, he's not a ghost. He's a, uh, you know, a real, uh, a real cartoon uh, character. So what are you, a small person in a big workshop? Oh, there's, see, there's the wolf. I saw there. I knew I, there's always a wolf out here. And the question is, is it just one? Come here, Mr. Wolfie. He's too bonesy to be a ghost. Yes, exactly. Yeah, it's a it's a very good comic. Everyone's little, and you do big orders. So is it is it like a simulation type of game, or you know where you just got to craft stuff or what? I really know nothing about the game, as you can tell. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Holy cow. I didn't even have time to turn off my mic there. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, where'd the other one go? Oh, yes. Yeah, Got to hydrate, probably. It's Sam, okay, good. Oh, and there's a wolf again, darn it. Oh, what the heck, I missed. All right, where's that wolf at, right there. And I picked up a stone, I didn't wanna pick up a stone. It was your first time playing it, okay. Is it like a newer style game or is it an older game? What is it? Again, I keep on picking up stuff that I don't really need and I'm overweight. Pink lemonade, not sponsored by Shippy. Yes, exactly. 
Uh, it is almost six o'clock. Well, actually, no, I'll be fine with uh, like A and W. You know, you got to go big. Give me, give me the big sponsor. You know. All right, let's go into town here. Hopefully, people will start moving. It's been out for a bit, I believe. It started on PC, but now it's on Xbox. Okay. Uh, a and W, that would be for root beer. All right, let's talk to Bernard here. You're just sitting alone here. We'll talk to you. Maybe get some more diplomacy points. What's up, Bernard? Uh oh, you like that one too? Uh, got a honey. There we go. Seventy-four percent. But I can't take you. I'm full. Not until I get some more. What are you doing up there? Holy cow. You're checking out your roof, I guess. All right. Matilda is in there. Come here, Matilda. I feel bad for anyone who's actually named Matilda. It just doesn't sound like a very appealing name. I mean, I could be wrong, but uh, just to me, it doesn't sound... All right, thanks a lot, Luke. Uh, I will catch you uh, later there. Um, sell everything, yeah. I want all your monies. Give me all your monies. All right, well, that wasn't a lot. But we're over 12,000 now, so we're good. Like I said, making money in this game is just too easy. Uh, and I'm not wearing my boots, huh? I'll go now. See ya. We're walking around barefoot, aren't we? No, our boots are on. Really? Do I have an extra pair of boots? I do. No. Clothing. Yeah, I'm not wearing them. Hmm. But it showed that I was wearing them. Weird. All right. Okay. Uh, what to do now? Now we just go back home again? I could buy some more sheep. That's all right. I think we're doing good. I think I got room to buy six more sheep, but we'll, we'll see. All right, that's annoying. All right. Um, where is home? Home, home on the range. Where my wife doesn't sleep with me ever. The people eat potage and nothing else because that's all we ever want to make them. All right. Calm down. There we go. <laughs> All right. So, um, I mean, I guess we could have bought, I don't know. I don't know if there's a spot where we can buy a bunch of vegetables. I know we can buy vegetable seeds, but I don't know if we can buy actually buy vegetables. I'm sure we could, but probably not in large amounts. Let's see what's in our good old storage here that we can craft. We just want to reduce some weight here. Or not weight, but just reduce. I mean, yeah, we're this thing builds up so fast. Um what can we do? What can we do here? We do have we have a decent amount of fur. We can make a bunch of sewing stuff, I guess. And we'll grab holy cow, I'm way overweight too. Wow, leather weighs a lot. And the, actually, no, the fur weighs a lot. So we'll, we'll do the fur first. And then we'll come back and grab the leather and maybe the linen. This is going to take a while anyway. Sewing is not fast. Here you go. Well, let's make some boots here. Boots with the fur. Five of them. That's it. And they're going to take 15 seconds each. That's like, you know, a million, a million hours. Yes, I'm bad at math. So, I mean, we knew that.
Yeah, you like that, don't you? I mean, it, it was kind of neat, and then they all kind of just went crazy. So, yeah. Oh, you know, it was wintertime, and I didn't even look to see if we had firewood. I should have looked to see if we had firewood. We'll look at uh, that once we um, make these fur boots here. I know it's the last day of spring and probably the last day of winter here, and we probably should have looked at it sooner. But, yeah, we're just not that good. And it's, bit, it's loud in here. Holy cow. All these new uh, sounds that they keep on adding in the game. You hear the, the loom going and the wheel going. Come on. And we're done. All right, good. So we made five boots. And actually, where is the sound coming from? Is it all coming from you? Then you're loud. All right. Um, firewood. I'm not seeing any firewood. And I only have 25 logs, so that's not good. Let's take these logs here, and then we're going to make some firewood out of them. Uh, get rid of this. Don't need that anymore. And I don't need the fur boots. We'll use those to sell later. All right, uh, craft firewood. Let's go. Again, they were probably they probably ran out of firewood and they were started using all my sticks and all my logs. I don't have my uh, person making. I don't think hardly any firewood because usually I just do it. But this will be good. I like it. Oh. So, Gargo, are you going for a third stream today or what? All right, so that should be 100 firewood. All right, good. All right, and what else do we have in here now? Oh, they already put more logs. I, okay, I got to have them turn off planks here. Uh, we have way too many planks. I didn't know planks weigh that much. Holy cow. All right, uh, we're just going to do this. I know I'm overweight. But management, no movie night tonight? Okay. Uh, where are we at here? Hunting, no, not the hunting lodge. I want the woodshed. That's what we want. And see, I only got one person working there too. Actually, I should have two. Why is there only one? Um, oh, they are making firewood. Uh, they could probably not make as many planks. So now I think I should have, I should be good on planks for a while. If we need more, we can either make them or whatever. Um, actually, we're going to do that and do that. There we go. I want the sticks. Okay, so then inventory, drop the planks. Um, let's do it in 50s, I think. 50 sounds good. There you go. All the planks on the floor. Pick them up. Put them over here with the rest of them. At least these, uh, oh, that's, oh, you got Aquaman. Okay, I haven't seen Aquaman. 
Actually, I, I mean, uh, Captain Marvel is a good movie. I like that movie. I mean, I like pretty much all the Marvel movies. The Marvel movies just did a phenomenal job. Oh, see, look at that. Just going crazy. But yeah, no, movie movie nights are good. You got to have those movie nights. I did a movie night last night, and I watched uh, My Spy. Uh, it's an Amazon movie um, with Dave Bautista from uh, Guardians of the Galaxy. Uh, it was actually really good. It was funny. You know, typical comedy type of thing. All right. Um, okay. Haven't seen Nita? Okay. Well, that, yeah, I haven't seen well, Aquaman. So uh, what can I see? get rid of here now what can i craft to make a bunch of stuff being that um we took all our sticks i mean i could use a straw and make straw hats but that's pointless i do have wool good okay we can make and i do have more wool thread okay so we can make um we could make uh more lanterns here uh what is that what do we need for lanterns here two logs logs leather and sticks and i don't have sticks uh, we have to go grab some sticks here So we'll grab some sticks. I got to make some torches here. So you know, we we you know, find all this really easy. I'm so you know, I I, I kind of wish that. You know, like some of this stuff wouldn't respawn all the time. Um, I know it's easier for the, uh, as a game developer that it does respawn all the time. Um, but I think if they, they had like a random thing, like some years would be, you know, lots of sticks. Some years would be very little sticks type of thing. And if you don't pick them up from a certain area, you know, nothing changes. I think that'd be kind of neat. It just sticks are so easy to pick up. Sticks and rocks. They're just so easy to pick up. Rocks, especially in the wintertime, they just they magnify, you know, so. But I haven't I haven't needed rocks in forever. I mean, I guess while well, I take that back, we just had to make some uh stone arrows, so. Uh, how many we got? 96. All right, let's go for the nice 100 here. Two, three, four. There we go. All right. I probably should have cleaned up the sticks inside my uh, town there, but that's all right. So now we just need leather, logs, and wool. And we can make a bunch more lanterns. Uh, but I don't have, oh, I need, uh, I, I never grabbed the leather, that's good. So we have plenty of leather. Uh, leather's not that heavy. I need to get some logs, not a big deal. And we need to get the wool thread. All right, we're gonna be a little overweight here starting off, but that's fine. Uh, grab a 20 log there. And there we go, come on. All right, where do we want to put one? I want to put one near the entrance here. Kind of light. I want to put one on each side of the bridge. I think that would be, look kind of cool. Never mind my recommendations signed out. Okay. I, I don't know what you were referring to there. I looked on Discord and I didn't see anything. All right, can we get one right here? 
we can, but let's put it by the bridge. You asked for a raid recommendation, I goofed. I found somebody playing FD, oh, okay. Oh, that would have been nice. Raid somebody doing Farmer's Dynasty? Yeah, that would have been really nice. Let's do one at each side of the bridge here. Really light up this bridge here. Okay, not the same height, but that's all right. All right, can we do... I'm off, got to set up my stream for YouTube. Have fun, everyone. I might be playing Ghost of Tushami. Nice. Well, thanks a lot for uh, joining us here, uh, Rachel. And uh, yeah, you have fun with your stream. That's another game that I've never watched anybody play. So... Uh, oh, you found somebody else? A boat and a boat dock would be kind of cool. Yeah, it would be. All right, I want to get it here. Come on, give me the green. There we go. All right, uh, not in the same spots, but that, I think that's going to look all right. Yeah, I don't know if they're ever going to be doing anything with these rivers. I mean, you can only go up to the bridges, though. The bridges are not high enough to get a boat underneath it. So, I don't know exactly what they would be planning on doing there. Oh, yes, yes. Like I said, uh, tomorrow, um, you know, gave you the times and all that. Uh, Four o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Uh, doing a nice community uh, day. So those are always fun. Oh, I am out of wool thread. All right, see you later. Catch you later there. All right, we're out of wool thread. And I don't know if I, I know I have more wool, but I don't know if I have wool thread. So we might have to make some more wool thread here. But it's getting to the point where I am going to have to leave. So Gargoyle, if you would do the honors and try to find somebody. Um, we'll make some wool thread here. And we'll wait until we can find somebody to go raid. That's if you're still in here, though. Wool. Oh, she just signed off too. All right. Uh, yeah, I try to find uh, somebody doing um, something. Uh, yeah, we just made our last little bit of wool thread here. So do we have enough to make another lantern? We do. We can make one more lantern. All right. Let's make one more lantern. We got to get the other one for this side. She's back. No mic on FD. Positive with the no mic though? Or is it just she not talking? Or he not talking? I mean, how do you know it's a female? Or is it just because of the name? That looks good there. Yeah. Again, different heights, but I'm okay with that. Looks like it got put in the same spot. Moody Princess. All right, we can raid her. I mean, is the content good? Or should we stick in Medieval's Dynasty? I mean, it's all about the content, you know. I mean, I, I would prefer somebody with a mic. At least got to have a mic. Um, actually, no, let's take all the leather here and we'll make uh, some some stuff here while we try to find somebody to raid here. And I know I'm dying of thirst here too. 
Uh, we'll make boots. Boots always go good. The noble boots. All right. All right, let's see if I can find somebody here to raid. Um, there's a lot of people doing this, but it's mostly German right here. All right, uh, I don't like your name. What are you? Hmm. Okay, maybe. Uh, what, what, what are they doing? They have a mic. I'm looking, I'm not seeing that person. Yeah, I know. I saw old geezer. I saw that one. Mike and a cam. All right. Uh, what game are they doing? Let's go raid them. One viewer? All right. Well, one viewer always wins. We want, we, we're always wanting to do that. So, um, guys, thank you very much for everything. Let's go raid this You Can Max. All right. So, uh, You Can Max. You Can Max, Medieval Dynasty. There we go. All right. Um, hopefully, he's English, so Gargoyle. <laughs> I don't know. But yep. All right, guys. Thank you very much. I will catch you all later. Uh, hopefully you all join in on the raid. Uh, that way we can continue our uh, medieval dynasty experience. So again, guys, see you all tomorrow. Uh, Four o'clock or 1600 Eastern Standard Time. Uh, we'll be doing our community fun event uh, day. So uh, you can jump on in or you can lurk and just have some good time, good fun. So... Thanks, Scott, guys. See you all later. Stay safe. Well, thank you very much, JQ. Only 14 people joining the raid. All right. No problem. No problem. Let's go raid. Thanks again, everybody. See ya.